I know this evening is a very beautiful evening in Springfield, Massachusetts, and we're going to go over the North End Bridge from Springfield into West Springfield. And it's one of three bridges that crosses the river from Springfield to go to West Springfield, one to Agawam. And we're going to see what this bridge has to offer. There's columns on one end, mm. see if there's columns on the other end, see if there's plaques or anything to tell us more about it. And tell us about the, the bike path that's there. The extension of Springfield Riverfront Park is right up here with a beautiful bike path. All right, so anything you want to know? Um, so when was the bridge built? It was built 1925, so next year it, it's centennial year. That's an incredible amount of years for a, a, a nice little bridge. It's very busy on the West Springfield Airway has a big roadie. But we'll see what it has to offer us. All right, so we can see the bike pass here. And this bike path is 1.8 miles long. It starts by Watson Avenue on one, one entrance, and the other entrance is down by the South End Bridge. It's a very long Connecticut River walk and bikeway. It includes the Springfield Riverfront Park. And it comes up here into the north end. All right. And it talks about Hamden Park used to be here, an athletic park. And it opened in the 1850s. And I'll get pictures of this onto my website. So this is a nice little place. Okay. And then you're going to pavilion back here. It looks like a kayak, rowboat, boat put in down here called the Pioneer Valley Riverfront Club. And then there's a pavilion over there for people on the bike path. And we can see the underneath of the North End Bridge. And this bike path goes for another maybe 0.6 miles from here. Okay, and this is the entrance to the parking area. And here's a sign. Welcome to North Riverfront Park, Pioneer Valley Riverfront Club. It has two columns on, on this side of the road and two columns on the other side of the road. They look very similar. And uh, there's a plaque on one side here. It says Honorable Representative Arthur McKenna Bridge, 1985. A self-sacrificing and devoted public servant son of Massachusetts whose inspired leadership over years, many years improved our highways and bridges, whose vision, courage, and, and entire efforts for a safe, efficient, accessible highway system continues to enhance the economic health mobility and convenience of our people all right and there's access from the other side too and these are made these columns look to be made out of granite okay and there's put-ins over here where you can see down into the kayak section and you can see under the bridge here it looks to be one two three four five six uh, supports under there and it looks to be a span bridge middle middle span bridge
you get nice views down the Connecticut River. You can finally see the railroad bridge in the distance. You can also see the memorial bridge beyond that with its lights. And then you can see over to the West Springfield side finally. And then on the other side of the road, you can see north from Springfield upwards. West Springfield, of course, is on the left. Springfield's still on the right, but in distance, you get to see Holyoke. Okay, a nice sunset today. Now, I'll, I'll start heading back. And so, the best way to get in here, this is one of the access points on Springfield's bike path. And you can get in through the boat put in area. And I'll show you about that. Okay, it's right over there. So I'm going to take pictures now and I'll sign off for you. And I hope you enjoy yourself out here. Thank you.